forget that God can do something in your life. God has to do So what I just say here that he, 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 Take your roles seriously and trust your God. What is it? So, in this life and in this season, God has instructed you. And I don't know what God instructed you because when Moses was being instructed by God in the mountain, you are not there. And the Bible is just recording a few things so that we analyze the whole situation. And also, when God was communicating to you and giving you that position, you were not there on a security. But you are the reason why God put you there. That believes that you are. So don't forget, don't forget, on a security. I was going to speak about serving God. But because of time, I won't, I won't start. If I get time, uh, uh, if I get a lot of I'll teach that what I say. But I just want you to serve God diligently. The very reason why we serve God is because we have to serve Him in the right attitude. And from the right attitude is where my God can bless you. Praise the Lord. Amen. You know you can serve God, but you're not having the right attitude. You are serving God hypocritically, or you are serving Him by virtue of, uh, of uh, just uh, emulating people or copying, but you don't have the right attitude. Why are you serving God? Praise the Lord. Amen. Why are you serving? You have to stand firm. You have to stand strong. You have to keep your faith. What is it? Don't forget to know that God has given you. And serve him right. Serve him right. Because this is your time to serve him. What is it? And every person has a mandate to serve him. It doesn't mean that it's only the leaders that can serve. You can also serve him. What is it? It's good when you never say you want to come up with one seat in a friend. It doesn't benefit you. Because what are you doing? Come here and have something to serve the Lord. Want to see you. Before they come, come here and wipe this seat. That is a blessing. When you go out, God can do something to surprise you. Hallelujah. So, serve the Lord to be any place. I wrote to my sister this particular morning and said, I said, that there was a woman, a widow, in the Bible, that, that was commanded to, 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 to serve the lighter. That woman, Yanni, she's a widow, Anna, and me. Can you give me back to me? Oh, you can go, go, and I can fill up the door. But now the lighter comes and sees, now you need to prepare and serve me. Now they say, you do, you give me back to me. He said, he put a million of the one and then he died. That's what she says. But now, but now you know that a miracle happened. And after serving the man of God, the oil and everything she had was one like one and So it means that it doesn't.